Hello, little birds. How are you doing? So, we have a video <coughs> going on today, and um, it will be a fragrance review, or I will try to describe a fragrance. So, I see many make videos about this, Melly Mel, and uh, many others. Don't remember all their names right now. <laughs> So I have a few fragrances here. For Black Warrior. Let's see. Real time. Of the cologne for men. And it says something there. You, maybe you can see. <laughs> Even with glasses on, it's a little bit hard. And I got fine gold for men, 999. Okay, so the black uh, warrior, maybe it's like the similar to uh, the high karate or something like that. <laughs> okay, so I have a piece of paper, maybe not the right one, but I'll spray on a little bit. And then I'm sitting outside. Uh, when it comes to my favorites, Skin Bracer is one of them. About that uh, aftershave, this is uh, Eau de Cologne. I use uh, aftershaves as perfume or, or anyway, sometimes. So. <clears throat> Uh, let's see, I have some notes here. Uh, so, anosmic odorless, no, it's not. Antiseptic, clean, pure, bland. Well, maybe it's clean. It's aromatic, maybe. Aroma, a smell strong, uh, pleasant, comforting, and you have a delicate, subtle, faint, not overpowering. Okay, it's not overpowering. <clears throat> but let's see, uh, descriptions I found here. Uh, <clears throat> this one. Aromatic, that's what I came up with. Okay, uh, I done a little bit research, but uh, I don't remember everything right now. You also have a, here you can have airy, uh, aromatic, astonishing, balmy, balsamic, beautiful, bubbly, and cheap. Well, cheap, yeah, this was quite cheap, and it's that's uh, so very good. Okay, we can try a little bit on the skin. Let air dry a little bit. <laughs> mm. Maybe a little bit woodsy, fruity. Let's see. So the yeah, here's what uh, it uh, does have. Mandarin. No, I don't think of that. Orange. Nope. Lemon. Little bit fruity, so maybe uh, maybe I could pick up lemon. Uh, Labdanium. I don't know what that is. I'm not that well versed. <coughs> Coriander, I, I really know because I make... Uh, Christmas cookies with coriander. <laughs> nah. Violet? No. Cedar? Yeah, maybe I can pick up cedar. Amber? <laughs> I don't know. Leather? Maybe a little bit when I think about it. Okay. So let's move on. 
then we have the fine gold and I also see people do let's see if I can find her <laughs> there it is they do this oh yeah I can feel it too so spray it on there for me it's very chemically not exactly chemically but very fake let's see what my first initial uh, first impressions of it was uh, fruity that's what it came up <clears throat> let's see and here is a <clears throat> very very fake or aromatic let's see let's try try here <laughs> so this is just an experiment guys and gals let's see fruity mm. very good uh, when you smell it on the skin but it's not my favorite I like uh, Skin Bracer, like uh, Aquaval Williams, I like uh, Floyd Blue, uh, like you know, I have a lot of the shades I use. It's like a modern, modern uh, perfume. Let's see, this is uh, have the toilet as well. Okay, let's uh, cheat. <clears throat> so, top notes. Peppermint, mandarin, grapefruit. Maybe grapefruit, peppermint. <clears throat> no, mandarin. Mm, a little bit maybe. Patchouli. <laughs> I'm not sure. Uh, that's the base notes. Patchouli. Amber. I don't know about that. Leather. No. Middle notes. Cinnamon. I know cinnamon. No, I don't pick up that. Spices. Maybe. Rose. No, I can't say I pick up rose. Fragrance category. Fresh. They are fresh, I can pick up. So let's see. Ah, yes, I agree. Okay, so that was that one. Is these two some, uh, these are very cheap. I bought in a store, cheap store in uh, Norway. It costs like 16 crowns each or something. It's something I would use maybe but it's not my favorites <clears throat> i prefer aftershaves let's see mm -hmm. okay so presentation cheap nothing uh, fancy nice glass it has the plastic uh, stopper but i took it off it works it's okay, but I don't like it. Will I buy it again? No. Okay, box. Nice glass bottle. You can. There. The spray or atomizer, what you want to call it, works. Okay, let's move on to the, uh, one of mine uh, that I have here. Here we have. Pal ciliary. Uh, <laughs> it says something there. Uh, Pal ciliary, Colonia. It's a little bit dark out here. Purissima. Okay. Presentation. Box is nice. That's something there. 
So <coughs> this was the rave uh, some time ago in the groups on Facebook. And uh, this is out of the toilet, 100 milliliter, milliliter. and it's 3.4 ah, so what do you say? So the box, very beautiful. And uh, I had to pay tax for it. It came from England. And they said it was uh, on the way out, and it was so fantastic good, that you will get you any kind of woman you wanted almost. <laughs> Some say. So I was a little bit skeptical. Is it uh, like uh, this or that? I said, well, but you have to try it. They say, okay, I bought it. Okay. So nice box. Comes uh, like so. There. Loose paper there. Comes with this very beautiful. Uh, I don't know what it's made from, or if it's silk. Uh, let's see. It says Pal Celery. Yeah, 100% uh, Seta Silk. Let's see. Okay. You can see it. So it's uh, very... You like to touching silk. You can blow your nose. <laughs> but that's probably not what it's for. Maybe it's for to wear in your dress, suit. To have a new suit. Very nice. So, you probably pay for this too. Do I, did I need this? No. I haven't even used it yet in my suit. Because actually, those things are a little bit old fashioned, but they're nice. <coughs> so, the bottle. Glass. Has like a paper band there. Greenish color. Wasn't attached properly. There. It's a nice cap. A little bit plasticky. Fake chrome. <laughs> or the. What do you call it? Mm. What I pick up is a wood scene. Maybe cedar wood. Okay, let's try. Maybe we can try this first. If we do this, woodsy, fresh. Let's try this. Maybe a little bit orange or something like that. Uh, fresh scent, I would say. Really good, and I'm not as enthusiastic as Melly Bell is, and he does this video, so he's like moving around and everything. <laughs> it's fun to watch. Uh, I'm a little bit more serious fellow, I guess. Fresh, good see. Okay, let's see. Let's use the lid sheet. So, pal, earth. Mm, I don't know if I pick up that. Let's try, try it on my hand. I can pick up maybe a fruity, also the wood. So uh, it says earth. I don't know if I pick up that. Sweet. Yep. Yeah. I pick up the citrus, yeah, somewhat, but not something I can easily pick up. Aromatic, <clears throat> um, maybe, fresh, yeah, already in there. Green, yeah, it's kind of green. Woody, yeah, I can pick up the wood. Let's see. So, yeah, 
No, it's not my favorite uh, Eau de Cologne. I probably used this a handful of times. But it does smell good. I like uh, when you think about skin bracer, you know, the, the spicy uh, or talk. It's something I really like, or aqua velva. You know, it's hard to describe that, but it's like an ocean or or something blue. <laughs> I could pick up the woodsy and uh, fresh, maybe aromatic. I smoke uh, aromatic uh, pipe tobacco, so I know a little bit about it. It's a little bit artificial, right? So that's my impressions of it. Uh, let's see if I missed out something. Citrus. Yeah, a little bit aromatic, I told you, fresh, spicy, mm -hmm. white floral. Yeah, maybe a little bit floral, but not so much. But the yeah, earthy, no, I didn't. So this is good to use uh, in spring. It says on fragrantica.com fragrantica and when it's hot, Daytime, yeah, and uh, most have gotten a lot of love there. So I'm dislike me. Is it my favorite? No, I rather use tabac, uh, you know, the cologne because it's a scent I really love. Why I'm not sure. This it's good. But it ain't uh, great. You know? So, yeah, I prefer using aftershaves as perfumes, or, you know, I, even if I didn't shave and I have a day, sometimes I use that. Just like my father did. <laughs> so, I hope you like my video. Trying to describe and uh, tell you my impressions. I'm not very good at this. Uh, some people have big uh, channels on YouTube uh, just doing uh, fragrance reviews. Uh, I can't pick it up and uh, need to sheet a little bit. Some things I pick up and other things I don't. So it's just an honest uh, uh, frag review or what you want to call it. If you want more, you let me know. I don't have that many uh, other toilets or perfumes or the colognes. I mostly use aftershaves and uh, yeah that's it so I will have a shaving video soon I just have to fin figure out what to do trying to make them interesting if you've seen my last ones <coughs> and uh, I will have that uh, Larry shave uh, soon I can't say when because I'm waiting for something uh, that I ordered on eBay so it will uh, takes time to get her and even more so now in the corona times so okay th thank you everybody for watching and may you all have solid shades bye now